Athens, Ancient Greek, Theta Nu Alpha Iota Athenai, Turkish, Athena, Armenian, Itenk, Latin, Athene, Italian, Athene, is the capital and largest city of Greece. Athens dominates the Attica region and is one of the world's oldest cities, with its recorded history spanning around 3,400 years, and the earliest human presence around the 11th-7th millennium BC. Classical Athens was a powerful city-state that emerged in conjunction with the seagoing development of the Port of Piraeus, a center for the arts, learning and philosophy, home of Plato's Academy and Aristotle's Lyceum. It is widely referred to as the cradle of Western civilization and the birthplace of democracy, largely because of its cultural and political impact on the European continent and in particular the Romans. In modern times, Athens is a large cosmopolitan metropolis and central to economic, financial, industrial, maritime, political and cultural life in Greece. In 2015, Athens was ranked the world's 29th richest city by purchasing power and the 67th most expensive in a UBS study. Athens is recognized as a global city because of its geostrategic location and its importance in shipping, finance, commerce, media, entertainment, arts, international trade, culture, education and tourism. It is one of the biggest economic centers in southeastern Europe with a large financial sector and its port Piraeus is the largest passenger port in Europe and the second largest in the world. The municipality of Athens had a population of 664,046 within its administrative limits and a land area of 39 square kilometers. The urban area of Athens extends beyond its administrative municipal city limits, with a population of 3,090,508 over an area of 412 square kilometers. According to Eurostat in 2004, the Athens' larger urban zone was the seventh most populous LUS in the European Union, with a population of 4,013,368. Athens is also the southernmost capital on the European mainland. The heritage of the classical era is still evident in the city, represented by ancient monuments and works of art, the most famous of all being the Parthenon, considered a key landmark of early Western civilization. The city also retains Roman and Byzantine monuments, as well as a smaller number of Ottoman monuments. Athens is home to two UNESCO World Heritage Sites, the Acropolis of Athens and the medieval Daphne Monastery, landmarks of the modern era, dating back to the establishment of Athens as the capital of the independent Greek state in 1834, include the Hellenic Parliament and the Athens Trilogy, consisting of the National Library of Greece, the Athens University and the Academy of Athens. Athens was the host city of the first modern-day Olympic Games in 1896, and 108 years later it welcomed home the 2004 Summer Olympics. Athens is home to the National Archaeological Museum, featuring the world's largest collection of ancient Greek antiquities, as well as the new Acropolis Museum. Etymology in ancient Greek, Athens' name was Theta Nu Alpha Iota a plural. In earlier Greek, such as Homeric Greek, the name was in the singular form, as Theta Eta Nu Eta and was then rendered in the plural, like those of Theta Beta Alpha Iota and Mu Upsilon Kappa Nu Alpha Iota. The root of the word is probably not of Greek or Indo-European origin, and is a possible remnant of the pre-Greek substrate of Attica, as with the name of the goddess Athena, who was always related to the city of Athens. During the medieval period the name of the city was rendered once again in the singular as Theta Eta Nu Alpha. However, because of the conservatism of the written language, Theta Nu Alpha Iota, a Theta Ein, remained the official name of the city until the abandonment of Katharevusa in the 1970s, when Theta Eta Nu Alpha became the official name. Previously, there had been other etymologies by scholars of the 19th century. 
Lobeck proposed as the root of the name the word theta omicron sigma or new theta omicron sigma meaning flower, to denote Athens as the flowering city. On the other hand, Dodolin proposed the stem of the verb theta alpha omega, stem theta eta to denote Athens as having fertile soil. An etiological myth explaining how Athens has acquired this name was well known among ancient Athenians and even became the theme of the sculpture on the west pediment of the Parthenon. The goddess of wisdom, Athena and the god of the seas, Poseidon had many disagreements and battles between him, and one of these was a race to be the patron god of the city. In an attempt to compel the people, Poseidon created a salt water spring by striking the ground with his trident, symbolizing naval power. However, when Athena created the olive tree, symbolizing peace and prosperity, the Athenians, under their ruler Scrops, accepted the olive tree and named the city after Athena. The city is sometimes referred in Greek as Tau Kappa Lambda Epsilon Iota Nu Nu Sigma Tau Epsilon, which means in English the glorious city, or simply as Eta Pi Rho Omega Tau Epsilon Epsilon Omicron Epsilon Sigma Alpha, the capital. History the oldest known human presence in Athens is the Cave of Schist, which has been dated to between the 11th and 7th millennium BC. Athens has been continuously inhabited for at least 7,000 years. By 1400 BC the settlement had become an important center of the Mycenaean civilization and the Acropolis was the site of a major Mycenaean fortress whose remains can be recognized from sections of the characteristic Cyclopean walls. Unlike other Mycenaean centers, such as Mycenae and Pylos, it is not known whether Athens suffered destruction in about 1200 BC, an event often attributed to a Dorian invasion, and the Athenians always maintained that they were pure Ionians with no Dorian element. However, Athens, like many other Bronze Age settlements, went into economic decline for around 150 years afterwards. Iron Age burials, in the Keramakos and other locations, are often richly provided for and demonstrate that from 900 BC onwards Athens was one of the leading centers of trade and prosperity in the region. The leading position of Athens may well have resulted from its central location in the Greek world, its secure stronghold on the Acropolis and its access to the sea, which gave it a natural advantage over inland rivals such as Thebes and Sparta. By the 6th century BC, widespread social unrest led to the reforms of Solon. These would pave the way for the eventual introduction of democracy by Cleisthenes in 508 BC. Athens had by this time become a significant naval power with a large fleet, and helped the rebellion of the Ionian cities against Persian rule. In the ensuing Greco-Persian Wars Athens, together with Sparta, led the coalition of Greek states that would eventually repel the Persians defeating them decisively at Marathon in 490 BC, and crucially at Salamis in 480 BC. However, this did not prevent Athens from being captured and sacked twice by the Persians within one year. After a heroic resistance at Thermopylae by Spartans and other Greeks led by King Leonidas, after both Boeotia and Attica fell to the Persians, the decades that followed became known as the Golden Age of Athenian Democracy, during which time Athens became the leading city of ancient Greece, with its cultural achievements laying the foundations of Western civilization. The playwrights Aeschylus, Sophocles and Euripides flourished in Athens during this time, as did their historians Herodotus and Thucydides, the physician Hippocrates, and the philosopher Socrates guided by Pericles, who promoted the arts and fostered democracy. Athens embarked on an ambitious building program that saw the construction of the Acropolis of Athens, as well as empire building via the Delian League, originally intended as an association of Greek city-states to continue the fight against the Persians. The League soon turned into a vehicle for Athens's own imperial ambitions. 
The resulting tensions brought about the Peloponnesian War, in which Athens was defeated by its rival Sparta. By the mid-4th century BC, the northern Greek kingdom of Macedon was becoming dominant in Athenian affairs. In 338 BC the armies of Philip II defeated an alliance of some of the Greek city-states including Athens and Thebes at the Battle of Cheroni, effectively ending Athenian independence. Later, under Rome, Athens was given the status of a free city because of its widely admired schools. The Roman Emperor Hadrian, in the 2nd century AD, constructed a library, a gymnasium, an aqueduct which is still in use, several temples and sanctuaries, a bridge and finance the completion of the Temple of Olympians' use. By the end of late antiquity, the city experienced decline followed by recovery in the second half of the Middle Byzantine period, in the 9th to 10th centuries AD, and was relatively prosperous during the Crusades benefiting from Italian trade. After the Fourth Crusade the Duchy of Athens was established. In 1458 it was conquered by the Ottoman Empire and entered a long period of decline. Following the Greek War of Independence and the establishment of the Greek Kingdom, Athens was chosen as the capital of the newly independent Greek state in 1834, largely because of historical and sentimental reasons. At the time, it was a town of modest size built around the foot of the Acropolis. The first king of Greece, Otto of Bavaria, commissioned the architect Stamatios Cleanness and Edouard Schaubert to design a modern city plan fit for the capital of a state. The first modern city plan consisted of a triangle defined by the Acropolis, the ancient cemetery of Keramakos and the new palace of the Bavarian king, so as to highlight the continuity between modern and ancient Athens. Neoclassicism, the international style of this epoch, was the architectural style through which Bavarian, French and Greek architects such as Hansen, Klenzer, Boulanger or Kaftantzog Lau designed the first important public buildings of the new capital. In 1896 Athens hosted the first modern Olympic Games. During the 1920s a number of Greek refugees, expelled from Asia Minor after the Greco-Turkish War, swelled Athens's population. Nevertheless it was most particularly following World War II, and from the 1950s and 1960s, that the population of the city exploded, and Athens experienced a gradual expansion. In the 1980s it became evident that smog from factories and an ever-increasing fleet of automobiles, as well as a lack of adequate free space due to congestion, had evolved into the city's most important challenge. A series of anti-pollution measures taken by the city's authorities in the 1990s combined with a substantial improvement of the city's infrastructure, considerably alleviated pollution and transformed Athens into a much more functional city. In 2004 Athens hosted the 2004 Summer Olympics. It also hosted the Miss Universe 1973 pageant, Geography. Geology Athens sprawls across the central plain of Attica that is often referred to as the Athens or Attica Basin. The basin is bounded by four large mountains, Mount Agaleo to the west, Mount Parnitha to the north, Mount Penteli to the northeast and Mount Hymettus to the east. Beyond Mount Agaleo lies the Three Asian Plain, which forms an extension of the central plain to the west. The Saronic Gulf lies to the southwest. Mount Parnitha is the tallest of the four mountains and has been declared a national park. Athens is built around a number of hills. Lycabetus is one of the tallest hills of the city proper and provides a view of the entire Attica basin. The geomorphology of Athens is deemed to be one of the most complex in the world because its mountains cause a temperature inversion phenomenon, which, along with the Greek government's difficulties controlling industrial pollution, was responsible for the air pollution problems the city has faced. This issue is not unique to Athens, for instance, Los Angeles and Mexico City also suffer from similar geomorphology inversion problems. The Cephasis River, the Ilissos and the Eridanos stream are the historical rivers of Athens. 
Climate Athens has a subtropical Mediterranean climate and receives just enough annual precipitation to avoid Köppen's BSH classification. The dominant feature of Athens' climate is alternation between prolonged hot and dry summers and mild winters with moderate rainfall, with an average of 414.1 mm of yearly precipitation. Rainfall occurs largely between the months of October and April. July and August are the driest months, where thunderstorms occur sparsely once or twice a month. Winters are mild and rainy with a January average of 8.9 degrees Celsius in Ni Philadelphia and 10.3 degrees Celsius in Helene Cone. Snowstorms are infrequent but can cause disruption when they occur. Snowfalls are more frequent in the northern suburbs of the city. The annual precipitation of Athens is typically lower than in other parts of Greece, mainly in western Greece. As an example, Joannina receives around 1,300 mm per year and Agrinio around 800 mm per year. Daily average highs for July have been measured at 33.7 degrees Celsius at Ni Philadelphia weather station, but other parts of the city may be even warmer, in particular its western areas partly because of industrialization and partly because of a number of natural factors knowledge of which has been available from the mid-19th century. Temperatures often surpass 38 degrees Celsius during the city's notorious heat waves. Athens is affected by the urban heat island effect in some areas which is caused by human activity, altering its temperatures compared to the surrounding rural areas, and bearing detrimental effects on energy usage, expenditure for cooling, and health. The urban heat island of the city has also been found to be partially responsible for alterations of the climatological temperature time series of specific Athens meteorological stations. Because of its impact on the temperatures and the temperature trends recorded by some meteorological stations, on the other hand, specific meteorological stations, such as the National Garden Station and the Sio Meteorological Station, are less affected or do not experience the urban heat island. Athens holds the World Meteorological Organization record for the highest temperature ever recorded in Europe at 48.0 degrees Celsius which was recorded in the Alefsina and Tatwa suburbs of Athens on 10 July 1977. Administration Athens became the capital of Greece in 1834, following Naplion, which was the provisional capital from 1829. The municipality of Athens is also the capital of the Attica region. Athens can refer either to the municipality of Athens, to Greater Athens, or to the entire Athens urban area. Attica region The Athens metropolitan area, sprawling over 2,928.717 square kilometers, is located within the 3,808 square kilometers Attica region. The region encompasses the most populated region of Greece, reaching 3,827,624 inhabitants in 2011, while it is however one of the smallest regions in the country. The Attica region itself is split into eight regional units, out of which the first four form Greater Athens, while the regional unit of Piraeus forms Greater Piraeus. Together they make up the contiguous built-up Athens urban area, spanning over 412 square kilometers. North Athens, West Athens, Central Athens, South Athens, Piraeus, East Attica, West Attica, Attica Islands. Until 2010, the first four regional units above also made up the abolished Athens prefecture, which was the most populous of the prefectures of Greece at the time, accounting for 2,640,701 people within an area of 361 square kilometers. Municipality of Athens The municipality of Athens is the most populous in Greece, with a population of 664,046 people and an area of 39 square kilometers, forming the core of the Athens urban area within the Attica Basin. The current mayor of Athens is Georgios Kaminis. 
The municipality is divided into seven municipal districts which are mainly used for administrative purposes. Population data for the seven municipal districts of Athens. First, 97,570 second, 110,069 third, 48,305 fourth, 87,672 fifth, 95,234 sixth, 147,181 seventh. 159,483 For the Athenians the most popular way of dividing the city proper is through its neighborhoods such as Pajkrati, Ambalokipi, Exertia, Patesia, Ilisha, Petrolona, Koukaki and Kipsuli, each with its own distinct history and characteristics. The Athens municipality also forms the core and centre of Greater Athens which consists of the Athens municipality and 34 more municipalities, which are divided in the four regional units mentioned above. The municipalities of Greater Athens along with the municipalities within Greater Piraeus form the Athens urban area, while the larger metropolitan area includes several additional suburbs and towns surrounding the dense urban area of the Greek capital.